This is 73 Tompkins Street. It's an eight bedroom house. It has two full baths and one half bath. We're currently entering through the back door. Right when you enter the back door, you have the laundry area, some storage cabinets. We do currently have some tenants living in here. We have one of the refrigerators and right when you enter is one of the full baths. So we do have a shower in here. And then again, the laundry area, back door where we entered and one of the refrigerators. So if we continue walking, we enter into the kitchen. So we have a dining table. The kitchen comes with the dishwasher, the microwave, the oven, and another refrigerator over here. And all of the storage cabinets. And then if we keep walking, we have bedroom one right outside of the kitchen area. So bedroom one comes with the dresser, mattress, as well as the big closet over here. So it's right outside of the kitchen area. And it also has the door to the front porch. If we go back into the kitchen, we have the hallway to the living room. So the living room comes with the big flat screen TV, the coffee table, all of that storage space. Two couches, that other coffee table and more storage space. So this is also right outside of the kitchen area. And then we also have flat screen TV. And if we continue down the hallway, we have a storage closet to our right. Then we have bedroom two. Bedroom two doesn't have the mattresses in them yet, but it does have the dressers and all the closet space. Then if we continue on, we have the front door to our left. And then we can go up the stairs to the other bathrooms and bedrooms. So directly up the stairs, we have bedroom three. Bedroom three has a storage and a dresser. Also comes with a mattress. That door does not open. We continue on. Bedroom five. Bedroom five comes with a dresser and a mattress. The desk was left from a student for another student returning. And it also has a closet. So 
So again, comes with the dresser, mattress, and the closet. We also have another full bath. And then if we go back through that hallway, there's another bedroom, bedroom four. So bedroom four, there's also closet or storage space in this hallway. And then bedroom four is off of that. So bedroom four comes with a mattress. The desk was left from another student. Dresser, as well as a closet. And that was the storage space down the hallway. We can go back where the other two bedrooms were and then the staircase. So if we go past the bathroom that we already saw, we can continue on the staircase. So right off the staircase, we have bedroom six. Bedroom six has this closet, a desk was left, comes with a dresser and a mattress. The table is also left. So then we came up from this staircase and we're continuing on. So they do have a storage area right here down this hallway. And then bedroom seven, which someone's living in there. So I cannot show that. And then bedroom eight. It's so bedroom eight, you enter and the closet is right there. And you can continue on. Comes with a mattress, dresser, and then the desk was left. And then that closet was on the right. And then we do have a half bath up here. So now if we continue back down that hallway, we pass the other bedroom and then the stairs in which we came up the second time. past the full bath and then the three bedrooms here. Back down the other staircase. And then we reach the front door, the other one bedroom, the living area, back into the kitchen. And that one bedroom was off the kitchen area. And then we enter to the laundry, the fridge, and the other full bath into where we entered. So where we entered actually has a storage closet as well. And then that is the back door.